Check out all the islands when you can. He's pretty sure he's heard of you before, although the details are maybe a little hazy. He wonders if you have something for him to drink. Says it's both everything you could want and never enough. Says you look like you've got a powerful thirst to do something in this world. Good. Bad, not really sure, but it seems like you've been drinking in your destiny and liking the flavor. Wonders if you could take the time to help a man slake his own thirst. You'd be doing him a liquid solid. You're a do-gooder, so you know you want to. Either way, he hopes you find a way to wet your whistle before the world comes to an awful dry end and leaves us all thirsting for more. Says life's like a mystery drink. Sometimes it's amazing, and sometimes it's awful. But either way, you sure, but that's nowhere near as quick and easy. Wants to stop to chew. Wants to raise a glass to you, getting the world fixed up a bit. Respects how you always try to help, no matter that the world's fate is hard to swallow. Oh, Seas joined up with the myriad. They like a peaceful drink, just like you. Something calm and soothing for your belly. But who cares about them? Says you'd be as bummed out as him if you came for the hot stuff. The glug mocker, Nim Him Bibble, and his favorite, Radium Syrup. That one's even more intoxicating now, aged in truck tankers and all. Aufschlag! Without a drink, and Radium Syrup especially, he can't move, much less think, as the power of his mind is directly proportioned to the quantity of syrup he swigs. That's why he's called Gulp. Aufschlag! The drink helps him forget the state the world is in, but it only lasts until tomorrow. The world is still doomed, even if the sun goes up. Says that's what gives your internal such a great glow. He wants you to know he has other interests, too. He's the Sir Felago's self-proclaimed ornithologist, for example. There are other ways than a cold drink to relieve stress, even in these dark times, and, fortunately for you, he can help. Watching Pippi's flap is calming, but better yet are the ones you can look at and touch, like quacks. Squeezing them is a great way to relax. They're better at floating than flapping, so you should be able to net a few without growing yourself a pair of wings. Luck, it'll keep you out of the goo. The Quack Hollow, it's just loonly.
that's not opening on its own. This story is as powerful as you'll let it be. starting to add up. Sharp and shiny. You need to line up the switches so they match. Bristles like the hair of one electrified. You need to line up the switches so they match. Bristles like the hair of one electrified. You need to line up the switches so they match. Bristles like the hair of one electrified. You need to line up the switches so they match.
Good. That's enough electric current to initiate the actuators and activate the framework. Fate is funny that way, but it won't always make you laugh. E-waste, the stuff you need. Gulp says he'll bibble anything once, as long as it's drinkalicious, even rocket fuel. He once mixed up some tankers and drank that. It was a real lift-off. That leads him to the bottom of that particular bottle. Radium syrup. If only he could find a tanker truck to empty. He's not in a state to go looking, so he's counting on you to help. Go find him a tanker truck and bring back some of that precious radium syrup, please. Thanks you for understanding how dire his thirst can be. Love to see you shine on. Oh, no one likes Perky. Perky's so uncool. The night may be cool, but you sure ain't. I am too cool. <laughs> if you have to tell people you're cool, you're not. Whatever you do, do it right, or don't do it at all. Thinks the world seems smaller now it's spinning down the drain. They saw a Terra Globus a while back. A round world map. Something like that might do a traveller like you some good. Oh, 
claims it's a map of the world painted on a ball. Says the Terra Globus would be easier to find if you had it, right? A world map like the Terra Globus would be so useful for a wanderer like you. Most never wander out of their region, but you, you're ready to see the world. Thinks you're the right person for the globe. Be careful down here, easy to get trapped. injured.
Flex those smart muscles and open the hatch. That should be enough glow juice for two. You look great. There's a change in the air. Feels like daybreak. Good thing you're strong. Gun it and go. Hey, you dumb up. Gamanu Gilolan. Gulp says he wants to take you with him on a super funny happy slide. Sharing is caring, and one drink for two is just right. Gulp says seeing your face is like seeing his own reflection at the bottom of a glass. It never gets old. He's been looking forward to a rendezvous, and it's on you to make it happen. There's even a chance syrup is more intoxicating now from being aged in a radiated tanker. I meet this. He's sure there are even more tanker trucks with radium syrup out there waiting to be emptied. Tells you that this time you can make it a double. Gulp says drinking shouldn't keep you from thinking. He wonders what's on your mind. 
child says goodbye to you. God thanks you, says a drink or two won't do any harm. He refuses to drink alone. You're his friend now. And now then, me. Gulp says he just can't get enough of that crunky syrup. It's so refreshing. Don't you agree? He really appreciated that you shared a drink with him. You took a risk and deserve a reward. So he intends to keep the promise he gave you when you first met. He's got a few things, you see. Settings are their goodness. Says he's always happy to make new ones rather than let the drink sit alone. Settings are their goodness. Gulp says he's heard a juicy rumor that you found an ark. He wonders what kind of drinks that might inspire. Hey, yo, Humbub. Figures that's inspiration enough for a whole raft of drinks. Hard to know what you'd do with an ark if the world survives, but maybe that's why it's still here, right? Says he's ready to toast your effort to keep the world juicy. It's drink-worthy either way. Wants to know if you might want a master blender along on your ark trip. So, what we have here is an opportunity to help your next. There's a seat open on the Ark should you want to offer it as a gesture of appreciation. Why? You don't need anyone else but yourself and me, of course, but I'm a part of you, so that doesn't count. If you want to go quickly, go alone. If you want to go further, go together. The only one we'd want to get away quickly from here is darkness. But you know you can't go on without me. Even if I'm bad company, I complete you. Hm. I think we can finally agree on something. It is better to be alone than in bad company. But best of all is being good company yourself. Cannot believe you chose him to go along. Says he's going to come up with a glorious new drink for your trip. It's hard to understand the guzzle, but it's something about flip-flop the flip-flops and not getting sourced. We'll be around when you return. <laughs>